Hello, everybody. Um, sorry about the no like video time, but today we will be doing Oreo's new diet and also her cage tour of this week because I do clean her cage every week and also spot clean every day because she is a very messy hamster. So just one second. And grab her bowls. Okay, just one second. So let me get her in something out of the hole. Um, also if there is any background noise, I'm very sorry. My dog, um, knows that my hamster is in my room because she's usually in my mom's office. So, I have three bowls. First, we'll do this bowl. And that is her Expo. Bowl, which I keep in a container like that. That says Axpo every day. Because I do feed her every day. I know people that do feed her every other day or. Yeah. So I give her quite a lot of Axpo just because she doesn't eat all of it, but I have. I might move her off Fox, but I don't know. There we go. So. Cause she doesn't really seem to like it as much as my other, my old hamster did. <clears throat> Sorry about that. So I give her around that much Axpo. Oh yeah, I also use this food in there. I'm just trying to get her used to like what Hazel Hamster has in there instead of just going straight to Hazel Hamster. So in there, I'll give her two little green pieces of it, two orange pieces, um, two tan. To yellow. And then I try to look for these pieces that I used to feed her like every day, but then we ran out of them. Here's a piece of it. They're like little axe bows, but in colors. So I just give her one of those because she has some on her hanging toys. Okay. I will also use that food later. So there's her Axpo, and now that is her, like, other bowl, I guess, if that's what you want to call it. Oh, let me move it so you can see that a little more. And I have this, which says, um, wheat germ, one teaspoon every, I used to say Monday, but now I do Sunday just because I'm more busier on Mondays, so I will give her one teaspoon of that. I'm actually running out of wheat germ. And I just keep a lot of my food in lock and lock containers, which lock on every side. And now she gets an Oatmeal Small Pinch every Sunday. And today is Sunday. So. And um, every other day I give her some sort of treat. And I keep mine in this homemade container. 
that used to be organic lollipops. <laughs> and I guess I'll just put a little yogurt chip. Because those are absolute favorite. And next we do pellet. Which is Care Fresh Complete Menu. And uh, that Sun Fun stuff that looks a lot like Hazel Ham. I might keep her on Care Fresh Complete Menu because she does seem to really like it. And I take my teaspoon scoop and I give her... Um, doo -doo -doo. Around five of those, and then I take out all the corn. And I have this bag that I picked out a ton of corn from, so there's some background noise again. So I give her one piece of corn from that. One sunflower seed, and today I will also give her pumpkin seed. So, that is all from this big pellet, con oh, sorry. pellet container. Oh, there's my shoe. Um, there's my mom. Okay, so then, um, I take some variety of seeds. She doesn't get this every day, the sun kind of stuff, because it does have a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of seeds, and it's more like a treat, because... It actually doesn't have much protein in it. Um, yeah, it doesn't have a lot of protein in it. So, um, some days I give her, like, dried carrot, nut. Um, like little dried banana chips. Um, fruit squares, which are dried fruit squares, and today she does get one of those. Today's like a treat, day, pretty much. Uh, to do. I did. I feel like I have more food to add to that, but I actually don't. Um, and then once every month, I give her a few pieces of hay and an almond. So, yeah, uh, to do that fell out of there. Yep, okay. Now I stick my teaspoon scoop over there. So now we will stick her food dishes into her thing. So, one second. Alright, guys, I'm back, and uh, this will be the cage tour part. She does. She lives in a bin cage, which is 116 quart and is around 648 square inches. So, she does have hanging toys, well, I, which I will show you at the end. But let's get started. Right here, she has her, her little, like, expo and some of those sun fun pieces. She doesn't get the sun fun pieces Every day, I forgot to say that also. Her eco Trishan Snack Shack Log, which she actually, she doesn't like chewing on things that she uses a lot. Like, some hamsters chew on their hideaways, or their wheels, or any kind of tunnel. She doesn't really like chewing on those, but she has took a few nibbles out of them. Over here is sort of like crazy. She went crazy last night because I cleaned her cage last night. She has some Easter grass, and this is paper, not like plastic. She has her salt lick, 
which she does have every um, cage to her. And just telling you for previous, she does chew on this. Um, there's a ton of bedding over there. I don't actually know if there's other chews over there. I need to spot clean over there, so don't mind that. She has her 8-inch comfort wheel in like a bluish greenish a toilet paper tube which she has started to chew on now I'm actually pretty happy about that a bendable log bended in a different way just because she doesn't really go over it but she likes climbing like if it's bent weird like she likes climbing up there and then going down so here's her pellet dish there's her, like, wheat jam and stuff. Here's her igloo, and she's actually sleeping right over there. Let me see if I can get her to wake up. Come here, little Oreo. I think she's about to wake up. Since, uh, yeah. So, let's put that back up. Uh, she does, she has a blue little juice stick right there, some more Easter grass, and, yeah, so, she also has a super pet plastic, yeah, plastic water bottle, and then there's a huge note over there for whoever babysits her. One minute, I will grab the hanging toys. I sort of like stuck them in. I make her hanging toys because all the other hanging toys she can't reach because they hang too high. So there's like a loofah and food one which she takes all the food off of. A ham hamburger, yeah, that had food on both sides but she took all the food off of there. And that is an idea from Chocolate Colors 26. And I just put a hole through it and then hung it by a string and has some food inside that she really likes. So, thank you for watching, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend, if you are watching this on to the day that it's uploaded, or on a weekend, and bye!